Losing her exhausting but fondly loved milk round is a blow to Karen. So I'm sending her and Gemma to an established events venue to see firsthand what they can expect if they continue with their new venture. Half an hour's drive away in Edgeworth in Bolton is the Wellbeing Farm, owned by Celia Gaze. She transformed her barns seven years ago. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow, this isn't what I expected, Celia. Crikey. So this is the main bit. bit. You've almost got to see this as where you could end, eventually end mm. up as. Mm. But at the beginning, this is not complicated to convert. Behind here, you've got your insulation, then your wood over mm. it. Yeah. You know, and I think it's about being creative. The gin bar we made out of a wardrobe. I think you're marvellous, the, the ideas you've had. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it's just, it's yeah. just great. Yeah. But it's not just the inside space that's important to consider. The animals are just as precious to her business. So here's your animals. Hi. Um, and these are obviously form a huge part uh, of the farm. It forms a real focal point, and whatever you do with your diversification, people want to see the animals. It's a yeah. huge part. This is one of our most popular areas that everyone wants to assemble <laughs> yeah. around. Hello. <laughs> uh, you all right? The events business is not always as idyllic as it might seem, but Celia has some advice that should go down well with Gemma. There's a lot of work involved. Um, and we do everything ourselves, literally from the catering to the bars to setting well, up to good, yeah. everything. Yeah. Um, but a lot of places, again, just do a dry hire, they call it. A dry hire in venue terms means renting out your space as a blank canvas. The venue can be used for any purpose, crucially with the client taking on the finer details. This venture requires minimal effort from the family and Celia's already spotted a perfect gap in the market. Well-being and yoga and all of the retreat space is huge. And people, especially because we're so near Manchester, want to be able to sort of get out of the city and go to, to these farms. Every day is different. I so love it. For mum, yeah. Don't be scared of failing yeah. because, yeah. You, you know, if you keep the building quite generic, mm. you won't waste money. Tapping into a booming industry of health and well-being, yoga and day retreats will allow Karen to slow down and explore something she really enjoys, while also returning a reasonable profit 